Welcome to Markham Greensboro, one of the most sought after neighborhood in Greater Toronto area. Today, we're excited to take you on a tour of the townhouse here and show you why this is such a great place to call home. This is a newly built freehold townhouse that was just recently occupied. But as you can see, it is not totally finished. The exterior is still under construction as is the pavement. You can still see how fresh this freehold townhouse is. As you can see, the townhouses here are modern, stylish, and offer a unique living experience. These townhouses are perfect for those who want to enjoy the comfort of a spacious home without the maintenance that comes with owning a traditional house. The Greensboro community is a large residential area in the most northeastern part of Markham, as you can see on the map. Greensboro is located in the northeast corner of Markham and is bound by the Ninth Line in the east, Markham Road in the west, Major Mackenzie Drive in the north and 16th Avenue in the south. This has been a fast-growing community since the Donald Cousins Parkway was completed in 2005, making this community one of the best values in Markham. As we know, the property closer to the 404 usually means more expensive. However, this community has an abundance of new and modern detached, semi-detached bungalows and townhouses that make it the most value-packed and has yet to benefit from what Markham can offer. Let's take a tour of this brand new freehold townhouse with a rare oversized floor plan just shy of 2,500 square feet and 10 foot ceiling with super bright large windows. You can see the foyer with the cold closet as we enter the front door. Just a few steps to the right we can find the powder room. Here you can also see how high the ceiling is as we enter the property. Straight ahead, just a few steps down, we can find a guest room or a study room, which typically we call a basement. However, this room is still sitting above the ground, and you can see that there is a door going to the backyard that is not fully finished at the moment. It is paired with a full-size washroom with shower head, perfect for elders that don't want to take too many steps or a perfect guest room. And once again, the high ceiling gives the room a much better spacious appearance. Again, here is the door to the backyard and you can also witness how much light you get in this room. In addition, there is also built-in closet. As we walk out of the ground floor room, on the left, we can find the mechanical room where the furnace and AC unit are. In the second door on the left, we can find the door to the car garage. This is a decent sized garage and you can also find the electrical panel near the garage door. now making our way to the front, so let's head to the main floor in just a few steps.
As you enter the main floor on your right, you can see the gorgeous living room with super large bright windows and 10 foot ceilings. Now going back through the stairs, we see the modern open concept kitchen with the island in the middle. There are so many upgrades in this beautiful, luxurious townhouse and a generous dining room with gorgeous chandeliers. It also has an unusual stainless gas stove with a great quartz countertop and high-end glossy ceramic backsplash tires. Making way to the other part of the living room, there is also a door to the higher ground deck that can also go down to the backyard. Once again, here is a look at the great dining area conveniently equipped with the open concept kitchen and the spectacular high ceiling lights. Now let's make our way upstairs where the bedrooms are. Look at the ceiling's height and the stunning large chandeliers in the center. On the left, we find the master bedroom. Immediately, you could see how bright the rooms were. The ceiling lights were spectacular and grand, with extremely large windows. Let's check out the walk-in closet. This closet is quite deep, with two sides perfect for the husband and wife. Let's not forget to check out the master bedroom's ensuite bathroom. This is a huge master bedroom bathroom with a great abundance of light through the large window and a beautiful bathtub on one end. There are two sinks with the shower at the opposite end. Now let's make our way out, and on the left, we find the laundry room with the sink. This is conveniently located on the second floor, so you don't need to bring the laundry to the basement like you usually do. Next, we have the second bathroom on the second floor for the use of the two other bedrooms. There 
There is also a linen closet located just beside the stairs and across the bathroom. Now let's make our way to the room on the left. As you can see, there is a nice ceiling light and large windows with lots of lights. There is also a built-in closet with a door. We have the same light fixture in the third bedroom, but this time with a door accessing the mini balcony where you can enjoy the sunlight and perhaps grab a coffee to enjoy. And here we can make a way out again, and there you have it the entire tour of the beautiful, luxurious free hotel house in Greensboro, Markham. As of the recording of this video in early April, I pulled the three most recent sales for some of the freehold townhouses in Greensboro so that you could get a better idea of the price at which they are currently selling. At the top, at 17 Hyderabad Lane was the most recent sale on March 29th, which only took 4 days to sell. 25 Upper Greensboro Drive out of the three comparable is the smallest unit. However, it only took one day to sell the unit. 247 Dundas Way sold for 1.23 million and still sold within 7 days. Overall trend, as you can see from the most recent past sales, is that prices are still trending up and it is incredible at the pace they were selling. Due to a lack of houses for sale, the properties are in high demand and prices are not lowering in the immediate area. I hope you enjoyed this tour video of this beautiful free hotel townhouse in Greensboro, Markham. If you find this video interesting and like this type of live walking tour of property in the GTA, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Also, comment below if you would like me to cover any homes that you may want to cover in the next video. Alright, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.